So we had today a very interesting symposium at ESMO in Madrid. As you know, we had two revolutions in the treatment of patients with advanced non-small cell lung cancer. First, the era of targeted therapies, and the second revolution is due to the tidal wave of uh, immunotherapy. So we have now more treatment options for patients with advanced non-small cell lung cancer, and the treatment algorithms are changing very fast. So it becomes more and more difficult for every physician taking care of lung cancer patients to find the best treatment option facing a given patient. So the symposium was dedicated to how to navigate between all the treatment options we have now for patients with advanced non-small cell lung cancer. We had three presentations during the symposium. The first one was given by Joachim Ertz from the Netherlands, who reminded us the importance to have a complete molecular profile for patients with advanced non-squamous lung carcinoma, and how the targeted therapies have changed the natural history of this disease. The second presentation was given by Peter Posmus from the Netherlands, and he described the treatment options we have for patients with advanced lung adenocarcinoma without any oncogenic addiction, underscoring the respective role of chemotherapy, immunotherapy, anti-angiogenic agents. And the last presentation was given by Robert Perker from Vienna in Austria, and he talked about the treatment options we have now for patients with squamous cell carcinoma, which is a hard-to-treat disease because of comorbidities due to smoking. And last, we had a very interesting and interactive discussion with the audience with a lot of uh, questions related to daily clinical practice. So I hope that uh, the audience uh, uh, have enjoyed this symposium, and I thank you for the organization of this very interesting uh, symposium. Thank you.